ಸದಾಶಿವಸಂಕರಾಚಾರ್ಯಮ್ಯಮ ಅಸ್ಮದಾಚಾರ್ಯಪರ್ಯಂತ ವಂದೇ ಗುರುಪರಂಪರ ನೈಷ್ಕರ್ಮ್ಯ ಸಿದ್ಧಿ ಥರ್ಡ್ ಚಾಪ್ಟರ್ ಸೆಕೆಂಡ್ ವರ್ಸ್ ಪೇಜ್ ನೈಂಟಿ ತ್ರೀ ತತ್ಪದ ಪ್ರಾಕೃತ ತತ್ಪದ ಪ್ರಕೃತ ಸ್ಯಾತ್ಪದ ಪ್ರತ್ಯಗಾತ್ಮನಿ ನೀಲೋತ್ಪಲವೇಕ್ತಾಭ್ಯಾಖ್ಯಾತ್ಮತ್ವಣೆ ಸುರೇಶ್ವರಾಚಾರ್ಯ ಇಂಟ್ರಡ್ಯೂಸಿಂಗ್ ದಿ ಮಹಾವಾಕ್ಯ ತತ್ ತ್ವಂ ಅಸಿ ಅಂಡರ್ಸ್ಟ್ಯಾಂಡಿಂಗ್ the maha vakya is very important to claim i am brahman i am not this body mind complex even though body mind sense organs are very much tangible at gross level and subtle level i am interacting with them i cannot be those body mind complex and sense organs this drudha gnanam form knowledge when a student receive in shravana kala itself it is a great wonder in shravana kala means at the time of listening from the teacher itself no more mananam no more nididhyasanam the assimilation happens at the time of listening from the guru that is very very rarely happens when it happens rarely means when the student is very keen in observing the guru's words exactly from what standpoint guru is talking going along with the range of that guru's words and the according to the guru's statements one who listen it is very easy if not one has to do mananam reflect upon the same teaching and one has to do nididhyasana therefore in this shravana kala uddalaka the father tells to his son shvetaketu aitadatmya midagum sarvam tat satyam shvetaketu tattvam asi shvetaketu ಸಿಕ್ಸ್ತ್ ಚಾಪ್ಟರ್ ಸದ್ವಿದ್ಯಾ ಮಹಾವಾಕ್ಯ ಈಸ್ ಕೆಪ್ಟ್ ಇನ್ ದ ಮೈಂಡ್ ಹಿಯರ್ ಸುರೇಶ್ವರಾಚಾರ್ಯ ಟಾಕಿಂಗ್ ತತ್ ತ್ವಂ ಬೋತ್ ಆರ್ ಪ್ರೊನೌನ್ಸ್ ಸರ್ವನಾಮ ಶಬ್ದ ಪೂರ್ವೋಕ್ತ ಪರಾಮರ್ಶಿ ಸರ್ವನಾಮ ಪ್ರೊನೌನ್ ಈಸ್ ಆಲ್ವೇಸ್ ರಿಫರಿಂಗ್ ಟು ಎ ನೌನ್ ದಟ್ ಹುಚ್ ಈಸ್ already mentioned previously that uh, noun is referring here in the pronoun that is purvokta paramarshi sarvanama the sarvanama definition is that what do you mean by pronoun tat is pronoun tvam is pronoun in mahavakya tat pada and tvam pada both are pronoun what is this purvokta paramarshi means uh, in chandogya upanishad uddalaka said to his father son shvetaketu sadeva aasit ekameva advitiyam tattvam asi shvetaket that sat 
was there at the time of creation in the beginning itself that sat is you are tat tomasi that sat you are the tat is pronoun what is purvokta paramarshi means sat therefore the grammar wise if you have some knowledge you can understand this if not is okay so okay sadeva soumya sat alone was there that sat tat sat tomasi you are this is the mahavakya this mahavakya in that sat happens to be the existence in taitri upanishad we saw and many upanishads also sat satyam gnanam anantam brahma that which is always existing at three periods of time independently is sat and that sat brahman the existence brahma swarupam sat is the swarupa lakshanam of brahman brahman is of the nature of existence capital e sat i the atma the sat i am lending existence to every nama roopa and chit also i lend to all sentient certain objects nama roopas i make them sentient i means which i lower i or higher i higher i lakshyartha i consciousness existence of principle brahman i am in the form of awareness that word is used here pratyagatmani in this shloka as i i i i am i am so amness refers to existence i refers to awareness inner self pratyagatma so that you are that sat existence consciousness principle you are you are not the body mind complex you are that awareness consciousness principle who is lending existence to the entire universe i am independently existing i lend consciousness to all the beings sentient beings i am not bound by time and space ದೇಶಕಾಲ ಅವಧಿಭ್ಯಾಂ ನಿರ್ಮುಕ್ತ ನಾರಾಯಣಯಂ ಫಸ್ಟ್ ಶ್ಲೋಕ ದೇಶಕಾಲ ಅವಧಿಭ್ಯಾಂ ನಿರ್ಮುಕ್ತ ಸಾಂದ್ರಾನಂದಾವಬೋಧಾತ್ಮಕಮಿದಂ ಅನುಪಮಿದ ಐ ಆಮ್ ಬಿಯಾಂಡ್ ಟೈಮ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಸ್ಪೇಸ್ ದರ್ ಇಸ್ ನೋ ಟೈಮ್ ಲಿಮಿಟೇಷನ್ ಸ್ಪೇಸ್ ವೈಸ್ ಲಿಮಿಟೇಷನ್ not only that i continues to exist even the nama roopas goes away easiness continues in the form of easiness i will continue pot is there we say pot is broken pot pieces are there if you put in the water mud is there easiness has gone not gone that easiness is non variable pot and pot pieces anything you take when you destroy any object it exists in a different form that easiness continues that easiness is called a non variable <coughs> anvaya what method sureshwara acharya following here anvaya vyatireka abhyam he said anvaya means that which anusyutataya vartate easiness 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 cannot be destroyed because it is not born therefore you cannot destroy it but this easiness the existence i the atma i am not available for transaction without nama roopa i the consciousness existence principle i am not available for transaction without nama roopa i lend existence i continue to exist i am not bound by time and space i am independently existing and i am not available when nama roopa are not there this is my nature 
body mind is my incidental vesham once uddalaka said this shvetaketu is supposed to say aham brahma asmi that mahavakya bhradaranyaka therefore in chandogya upanishad panchabhuta srishti is not taken only three bhutas taken only three that's why trivrut karanam not panchi karanam trivrut karanam means annamayi aapo annamayam annamayagum hi somya manaha aapo mayi pranaha tejo mayi vak tejo bannam chandogya upanishad we saw tejo bannam the whole world is made out of water fire and earth other two are included you have to take so therefore atma the brahman atma means what apnoti sarvam that which pervades in everything sat chit sat chit that is called atma yadadatte yat atti um, yet which pervades everything in called atma therefore like water alone appears as bubble wave and uh, vapor in different forms one water different ways similarly one sat alone chidrupena sadrupena in every nama roopa you have to discern understand my ease book is pen is house is fan is everything is 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 you are experiencing the object existent object or non existent object existent object only you are experiencing therefore that easiness you have to see behind that object which is formless you have to understand you cannot see it because it is formless that is the idea presented by uddalaka to shweta ketu so all that experienced objects are only superimposed upon atma brahma chaitanyam which is my real nature you have to negate nama roopa so that is why uh, shweta ketu has to say i experience atma he should not say you cannot experience atma pure existence of your consciousness no one can experience even nama roopa existence consciousness also you cannot experience you need not experience you are that so presupposes every um, the prakasha in your room it is light is there all objects are available so the so light is pre, right presupposes before the experience of every object light is uh, presupposes to be there before seeing the all the objects without light you cannot see any object light is taken as granted what are all there in the room na you say fan is there book is there pen is there table is there cot is there you say you never say light is there because of which light you are able to talk about all these uh, things <coughs> similarly in this world also what is there means a tree is there ocean is there mountain is there like that you say you never say because of which isness mountain exist because of which isness tree exist which of because of which isness fan exist we have taken it as granted if you are taking it as granted there is one tragedy if you forget about that which is the lending existence to nama roopa you mistake yourself your body mind complex that is the problem this is called avarana vikshepa ishvara srishti is wonderful no problem at all but you forget the truth behind the nama roopa you mistake uh, tree is real fan is real behind that sun mula manvichan vacharam bhanam vikaro nama dheyam mrittika ityeva satyam statement how powerful it is 
సన్మూలం అన్విచ్ వాట్ ఈజ్ ద మూలం ఫర్ ఫ్యాన్ ఈజ్ బుక్ ఈజ్ హౌస్ ఈజ్ అన్న మూలం ఈజ్ నాట్ మూల విద్య మూలం ఈజ్ ద రూట్ ఈజ్ సత్ 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 when it comes to the individual living being chit 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 eskeva spuranam sadatmakam sat kalpaarthakam bhasate sat rupena chit rupena i am everywhere that is said in this shloka look into this shloka so body mind complex i am not consciousness alone i am this i have to own up as early as possible the early you own up the more you enjoy your life as a gnani you can enjoy he gives one example for that see first line tatpadam prakritartham tatpadam తత్వం అసి మహావాక్యం ప్రకృతార్థం దట్ హ్యాస్ గాట్ కాంటెక్స్టువల్ మీనింగ్ తత్పదం మీన్స్ దట్ దట్ మీన్స్ యూ షుడ్ నాట్ టేక్ ఎనీథింగ్ దట్ పర్సన్ దట్ బుక్ దట్ హౌస్ దట్ మీన్స్ ఎనీ సర్వనామ క్యాన్ రిఫర్ టు ఎనీథింగ్ ఎనీ ఆబ్జెక్ట్ ఇన్ ద వరల్డ్ సర్వనామ దట్స్ వై ఇట్ ఈస్ కల్ సర్వనామ that tat that tat is equal to that dakarantaha tat shabdaha that tat here is prakritartham prakritartham the contextual meaning it has got you cannot take that means that tree that pen that book that person here in this context you have to take prakritartham contextual meaning from that mahavakya uddalaka said to svetaketu tatvamasi mahavakya of chandogya upanishad you have to take that is the meaning of prakrutarthaha syat prakrutartham syat that said svetaketu received from his father that tat you have to take what is that tat సెంటెన్స్ హట్ రిమంబర్ ఛాందో గ్యోపనిషత్ సదేవ సౌమ్య ఇదమగ్ర ఆసీత్ ఏకమేవాద్వితీయం తత్వమశి శ్వేతకేతో ఐ తదాత్మ్యమిదగుం సర్వం దట్ సత్ ఈజ్ ఆత్మ అగేన్ సి హిస్టేస్ ఐ తత్ ఏ తత్ ఆత్మ ఇదగుం సర్వం దట్ సత్ ఈజ్ ఆత్మ దట్ ఆత్మ హ్యాపెన్స్ టు బి యువర్ సెల్ఫ్ దిస్ ఈజ్ ద టీచింగ్ Vedanta has got lot of lot of prakriyas, teaching, 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 on and on and on. Such a subtle subject, you have to focus your mind. Tvampadam Pratyagatmani Where you have to take this Tvampada of Mahavakya? You should not ask what is Mahavakya. Okay, I will be in trouble. నెక్స్ట్ మీ శుద్ధి స్టూడెంట్స్ ఆర్ నాట్ సపోజ్ టు హ్యావ్ సచ్ డౌట్స్ త్వం పద యు యు త్వం మీన్స్ యు యు ఆర్ దట్ యు ఆర్ దట్ బ్రహ్మన్ సో యు వెన్ గురు ఈజ్ ఫోకసింగ్ రిఫరింగ్ టు ద స్టూడెంట్ యు ఆర్ షోయింగ్ లైక్ దిస్ ఫింగర్ యు ఆర్ యు ఆర్ యు త్వం యు హ్యావ్ టు focus on pratyagatmani not body you means guru said not body not mind not manomaya kosha not pranamaya kosha not annamaya kosha not vijnanamaya kosha not anandamaya kosha the five koshas behind that pratyak atma inner self inner self which is formless inner self that which is in the form of awareness i am i am i am so that i am will never change that is anvaya i am is non variable what i am is variable i am whenever whoever says wherever that i am there is no change in any language you say i am i am i am everybody has to use 
बट आफ्टर आई एम वॉट एवर दे एड आई एम ए डॉक्टर आई एम ए इंजीनियर आई एम ए टीचर आई एम ए लेक्चर आई एम ए सम वन अदर जॉब आई एम ए मेल आई एम ए फीमेल आई एम ए वाइफ आई एम ए हजबेंड वॉट एवर यू एड टू दैट आई एम इज वेरिएबल चेंजिंग डिफर but i am is anvaya what i am is uh, vyatireka it is vyatireka means it is uh, not continuous doctor mother father you are father from your son standpoint you are not always father you are grandfather from your grandson standpoint you are a neighbor from neighbor's standpoint so changing variable vyatireka that what is changing variable you are not he gave example neela utpalam up to here we saw in the last class this neela utpalam is uh, the example taken by sureshwara acharya and this is shastrik example classical example what is that neelam utpalam here he mentions neela means blue blue lotus utpalam you can take lily or a lotus some type of flower like uh, blue lotus in the statement neelotpalam uh, neelotpalavat etabhyam whenever a person say this is blue lotus blue lotus means what there are many lotuses many flowers are many objects suppose suppose you take many flowers are there or many lotuses are there many lilies are there white color is there pink color is there when i mention the blue ness of that lotus what i mean i am focusing on blue lotus not pink lotus not white lotus what am i doing i am not interested in white lotus pink lotus i am focusing on blue lotus blue lotus both are where is blueness there is a lotus where is lotus there is blueness in that point whenever i say blue lotus lotus and blueness are not different in blue lotus statement lotus and blueness are together one entity only one entity it is not two things neelam is different utpalam is different you cannot say utpalam is equal to blue blue is equal to utpalam in this blueness blue st- lotus statement one entity only that is neelotpalavat that is here um, the example you have to extend to drashtanta this drashtanta you have to take drashtanta in the drashtanta lotus example uh, first understand properly i am Uh, negating all other flowers vyavritti i am negating i am refuting anya vastu vyavrt vyavritti hi ut utpala bhinna anya vastu ni this is anya vastu vyavritti hi means uh, i am not uh, i am negating white lotus i am negating a few pink lotus but i am focusing on blue lotus in the example or same blue lotus you can take i am not talking about book or fan or suppose there is a blue lotus on my table the blue lotus and i say you have to negate what are all things i am not talking about light i am not talking about mic i am not talking about book i am not talking about fan i am talking about only blue lotus so anya vyavrutti hina other things i am negating i am not interested in them i am interested only in blue lotus understand so this blue lotus 
this we saw in Vedanta Sara also. I took long before Hintinagar class um, that Nilotpalam Vedanta Sara is discussed there. Uh, next shloka also he takes from Vedanta Sara only. Vedanta Sara is elaboration of Tattva Bodha. Viveka Chodamani like book. So very, very technical. So that um, Vyavritti Utpala Bhinna Anya Vastuni Vyavritti. What is Utpala Bhinna? Other uh, uh, flowers or other things, other objects, Bhinna uh, Vastuni Vyavritti. I am I am keeping them aside. I am focusing on Utpala. So what? Why I have to think so much about lily, 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 blue lotus? Because, because you come to Dashtanta now. When Guru says, Tat Tvam Ase, you are that. You are that means what? You, that uh, is described as what? Brahman, Anando, Brahmi, Divya Janat. Ananda Dheva Kalvimani Bhutani Jayanti Ananda Najatani Jeevanti Ananda Original Ananda Shuddha Ananda is the nature of Brahman. When Guru says you are Brahman, Brahman is equal to Ananda. Brahman is equal to Ananda. That means you are Ananda. You are Brahman, Guru says. Tat Brahma, you are. So, Brahman nature is what? Ananda Swarupam. Ananta Swarupam. Infinite nature. Finitude is not there in Brahman. Then when I say Aham Brahma Asmi, Aham must be Brahman. I am Brahman. Since Brahman happens to be Ananda Swarupam, I also must be Ananda Swarupam only. But Dukhyatma, Dukhyanatma, Niva Avarani. See, Anatma Avarani. Dukya Anatma Avarani. Nilot Palavat Padeta Eta Bhyam. You have to do Anvaya Vitreka. Dukham belongs to the body mind complex. I am not Dukhi. So, Vyavritti. You have to negate. Other uh, objects just you have negated, Nilotpalam, Blue Lotus. You are focusing on only Blue Lotus, not any other objects. Whenever Guru says you are that, you should not think about body. You should not think about the mind. You should not take worry mind. Correct? You should not take uh, sorrowful mind. You should not take uh, a diseased body or painful body as yourself. So, Vyavritti. You have to remove all other things. Dukhitvam, you have to remove. Intellectually. Guru said that you are Brahman, happens to be Ananda. That means, Anananda Rupa, Sharira, Manaha. You have to keep it aside. You should not take yourself. I am uh, experiencing, Sishya says to Guru, suppose, I have sorrow, I am worrying so much, lot of worry is there. Guru says, you don't have worry at all, you don't have sorrow. I am experienced. Guru says, since you are experiencing, you don't have sorrow. What you experience is not you. The experiencer is different from the experienced sorrow. You are experiencing sorrow. Sorrow is different, you are different. You are the subject, sorrow happens to be object. Simple logic. Guru says, since you are experiencing, you are not sorrowful. I am sorrow, you don't say. I have sorrow, you say. What you have you, is not you. That is why here Acharya says, Dukhi, Dukhi, Anatma, Dukhya, Dukhya Anatma. Here Anatma keeps separately. Dukhi, I am Dukhi. 
I am sorrowful. I am worrying. I am sad. That belongs to whom? When Guru said Tattva Masi, the whole uh, uh, combination, components, body is there. Sthula Shariram, Sukshma Shariram, Karana Shariram, Ahankara is there. Angushta Matra Purushaha also there. Which one we have to take in these five? Our five finger Vedanta. Hmm? I cannot take myself as a subtle body, I cannot take myself as a gross body, I cannot take myself as a causal body, I cannot take myself as a reflected consciousness. These are all belong to lower I, Anatma. I have to take Angushta Matra Purushaha. Brahman is not of the thumb. Angushta Matra Madhya Atma Nitishthati. Important Anatma, significant. Which finger is important in all these fingers? And the most thumb. Thumb is the important. That's why we show thumb. <laughs> ah, well done, wonderful. We never show one finger. Well done, wonderful. Why you show thumb only? Okay. Ah. So in the WhatsApp, of, it comes, you know, everybody sending the symbols. Ah. Wonderful, good, excellent. So, I, the Angushta Matra Purusha Brahman is wonderful only. Correct? So, I am not a Dukhi. That Vyavrati. Vyatireka. I have to negate. Just as when a blue lotus is a pink lotus, you have kept aside. White lotus you have kept aside. Like that here also. Tat Tvam Asi. Tat Eva Tvam Tvam Eva Tat. Blueness alone is lotus. Lotus alone is blueness. Both are one entity. Correct? Tat and Tvam both are one entity. Tat Brahma or Paramatma you take. In Paramatma you have to remove all that Sarva Gnatam, Sarva Vyapitvam, uh, all those Nama Rupa at a total level. Jiva also you have to remove other things. What are all Alpa, alpa Vyapitvam, Alpa Gnatvam, the desha, kala, parimiti, all you have to, should not take. Only one entity is what? Paramatma is also Atma. Tat, I am also Atma. Therefore, that Tat is equal to Tvam. I am Brahman. So, Brahman and myself are not different. One and the same entity. Neelam and Utpalam both are one, not two. Tat and Tvam are not two. That and you, that Brahman and you, the Atma, Consciousness, Principle. Tat you can take Sat. Sat is equal to Chit. Chit is equal to I, the Consciousness. Therefore, I am Sat. Sat is equal to Brahman. Sat is equal to Chit. Therefore, I am Chit, I am Consciousness. Are you a conscious being or not? Are you conscious of my words? So, you are Consciousness. Consciousness is Sat. Sat and Chit are not different. Therefore, I am Sat Chit. That Sat Chit word you are presenting as I am. For Chit you are using the word I. For Sat, you are using the word am. This you understand enough. So that I am, I am, whenever you are telling, indirectly you are telling, I am Sat, I am Chit. I am Sat and I am Chit. But unfortunately, because of Avarana, I take I am body, I am mind, I am father, I am mother, I am daughter. That I take. That is the mistake. People commit. Ignorant people commit. Therefore, I am not father, mother, brother, sister or any relation. But I am is Satyam. What I am is not me. They belong to me. But not me. What is me? Mine is not me. What is mine? My body, my mind, my... Oh, sense organs. What is mine is not me. My handbag. You know all this 
I don't want to dwell upon this. Therefore, from Brahman, I remove that uh, um, total, uh, all um, uh, attributes, I remove and I, being the subject, that next word, Anatma Varani, Anatmatma Varani, hmm. objectiveness I have to remove, Dukhitva Anatmatva, Dukhitva limitations at uh, uh, individual level, Anatmatva means uh, whatever you objectify, object, it is Anatma. Varana means what? You have to stop. Nivarana. Varani for the sake of objectiveness. Objectiveness. Anya Deva Viditad Adho Abhititad Adhi. I, the Brahman, am neither known nor unknown. I, the Brahman, am neither known. If I know Brahman, it comes under object. It is unknown if I say also, it comes under object. Therefore, I the Brahman am neither known or unknown. That is the meaning of Anatmatva Varani. To uh, remove that notion, I want to experience Atma. When can I experience Atma? That notion you have to break. Because if you want to experience, you are bringing the Atma into an object level. Because whatever object other than me, the subject, is an Atma. Understand? Whatever I am experiencing, object. Book is an object. Fan is an object. If you want to experience Atma also like any other object, you are innocently eh, bringing the Atma into object status. Whatever is object is an Atma. It is not Atma. You want to make this subject I the Atma into object status. Therefore, Anatmatva Varani. Where is that word? In the sloka. You see the second line. Dukhi, dukhi Anatmatva Varani. So, Dukhi, I am Dukhi, Ananda Swarupatma. Ananandam, Dukhi, Anana, no Ananda. I am not the mind which is undergoing lot of emotions. Really speaking, I lend existence to that uh, worrying mind, which is sorrowful mind. I lend sentiency to that sorrowful mind. How can I am sorrowful? My mind is sorrowful. I am not the mind. Mind has got lot of issues. Let them be there. I am not sorrowful. Dukhitva Nivaranam. Anatmatva Nivaranam. Never try to experience Atma. Never. You are the experiencer who is desirous of experiencing Atma. He is the Atma. The desirer who is interested in experiencing the Atma is the Atma. You need not desire to experience Atma. If you experience Atma, you cannot experience, first of all. If you want to experience, you are converting the Atma into object status, you are converting Atma into Anatma. What a blunder people are doing. Many, many, many people, in spite of studying Vedanta, for a length of time from a guru, innu varle, innu varle, innu varle, innu varle, experience varle. Enna experience, Atma experience varle, innu, konja kavale. Itta nada padichin ne irke ne, innu Atma anubhava varle ye, varle ye, Atma anubhava has not come. Where? Easily people fall. Not so easy. That's why Guru's blessing, Guru's grace is required for this. Never look forward to experience Atma. Puja Swami Ji says, Atma Anubhava you need not get. You are already having Atma Anubhava. You have to get only Atma Jnanam. 
ఐ డోంట్ స్ట్రగుల్ ఫర్ ఆత్మ అనుభవ అనాత్మత్వ వారణి పవర్ఫుల్ స్టేట్మెంట్ వండర్ఫుల్ శ్లోక ఓకే లెటర్స్ కమ్ టు నెక్స్ట్ శ్లోక సో మచ్ యూ కెన్ టాక్ నన్ వన్ వన్ వర్డ్ నైంటీ ఫోర్ పేజ్ నెంబర్ థర్డ్ వర్స్ ఇంట్రడక్షన్ వయ వ్యతిరేక వాక్యాదేవ అవాఖ్యాం ప్రతిపద్యుక్త అతస్తవ్యాఖ్యానాయ సూత్రోపన్యాస సూత్ర ఉపన్యాస ఏ బ్రీఫ్ ఉపన్యాసం ఐ ఎమ్ గోయింగ్ టు లెక్చర్ Uh, and this whole Tattvamasi Mahavakya in brief nutshell, Sutra Upanyasaha. Say, so, um, brief uh, explanation. Gevam in this manner, I the consciousness am who is non-variable. Whatever I experience is variable in this manner, Nilotpalam Dukhitvam. నీలోత్పలవత్ ఐ ఆమ్ ఐ ఆమ్ దట్ ఎగ్జాంపుల్ దృష్టాంత అండ్ దాష్టాంత దట్ సత్ చిత్ అండ్ ఐ ఆర్ నాట్ డిఫరెంట్ బ్రహ్మన్ హ్యాపెన్స్ టు బి సత్ చిత్ ఐ ఆమ్ ఆల్సో హ్యాపెన్స్ టు బి సత్ చిత్ ఐ మీన్స్ వాట్ ఆర్ ఆల్ యూ హ్యావ్ నెగేటెడ్ దుఃఖిత్వం దేశ దేశ పరిమితి కాల పరిమితి ఆల్ యూ హ్యావ్ దట్ ప్రాక్సిమిటీ యూ హ్యావ్ టు టేక్ ప్రాక్సిమిటీ నా where how far atma is uh, dif- uh, distant from me how far sat and chit uh, mm, i am away from, from brahman sat and chit i am whenever i say i am alone sat chit how far i am away from brahman you cannot be away from brahman because you are brahman you are not body mind complex you are brahman therefore you cannot be away from brahman you are brahman now here itself only this much brahma gnana only this much ah this much only assimilate it own up claim before leaving this body as early as possible hmm? evam in this manner krita anvaya vetirekaha we have done అన్వయం వ్యతిరేక వేరియబుల్స్ ఇన్ ఆల్ వేరియబుల్స్ ఐ ది ఆత్మ ఐఎమ్ నాన్ వేరియబుల్ ఇన్ ద ఫార్మ్ ఆఫ్ సత్ చిత్ సత్ చిత్ సత్ చిత్ ఎవ్రీ ఆబ్జెక్ట్ ఈస్ క్యారీయింగ్ వాట్ సత్ 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 ఇరుకే ఇరుకే ఇరుక తెలుగులో ఉన్నది 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 ఈజ్ దేర్ ఈజ్నెస్ 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 దట్ ఈస్ అన్వయ book is not pen pen is not fan fan is not table table is not uh, door door is not floor uh, variables they are so um, own up claim understand uh, the non variable in all variables <laughs> body mind variable body is not mind mind is not body body is not sense organ sense organ not uh, mind so they are variables i am is not variable i am is not variable not changing ever the same when you say i am body my body i am body i am body i am the mind i am the suppose you say also what are all variables body mind sense organs i am is not variable anywhere in any human being talking i am only they have to use mai hu nenu unnanu nan irken language may differ but nan irken mai hu nenu unnanu i am non variable what a nice teaching how one can miss this teaching eh that's why require lot of punya anvaya vetreka variables are all existing because of non variable i am island existence island consciousness 
ಐ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ಗೆ ಲಕ್ಷಾರ್ಥ ಓಕೆ ವಾಕ್ಯಾದೇವ ಅವಾಕ್ಯಾರ್ಥ ವಾಕ್ಯಾದೇವ ದಿಸ್ ನಾಲೆಡ್ಜ್ ಇಸ್ ಪಾಸಿಬಲ್ ದೇರ್ ಆರ್ ಮೆನಿ ಮೆನಿ ಪೀಪಲ್ ಟಾಕಿಂಗ್ ಅಬೌಟ್ ಸೆಲ್ಫ್ ರಿಯಲೈಸೇಷನ್ ಐ ಗಾಟ್ ಸಿದ್ಧೀಸ್ ಐ ಗಾಟ್ ದಿಸ್ ರಿಯಲೈಸೇಷನ್ ಐ ಗಾ ಐ ವೆಂಟ್ ಟು ಟ್ರಾನ್ಸ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಟ್ರಾನ್ ನ ಟ್ರಾನ್ಸ್ ಟ್ರಾನ್ಸ್ ಲೈಕ್ ದ್ಯಾಟ್ ಪೀಪಲ್ ಗೋ ಆನ್ ಟಾಕಿಂಗ್ ಶಾಸ್ತ್ರ ಸೇಸ್ ಫೂಲಿಶ್ ಫೆಲೋ ಫೂಲಿಶ್ಲಿ ಡೋಂಟ್ ಟಾಕ್ ವೈ ಟು ಗೋ ಟು ಟ್ರಾನ್ಸ್ ವೈ ಟು ಗೋ ಟು ಟ್ರಾನ್ಸ್ ಹೂ ಈಸ್ ಗೋಯಿಂಗ್ ಟು ಟ್ರಾನ್ಸ್ ಮೈಂಡ್ ಓನ್ಲಿ ಗೋಯಿಂಗ್ ಯು ಆರ್ ನಾಟ್ ದ ಮೈಂಡ್ ವೈ ಟು ಗೋ ಟು ಟ್ರಾನ್ಸ್ ಸೆಲ್ಫ್ ರಿಯಲೈಸೇಷನ್ ವೈ ಟು ರಿಯಲೈಸ್ ಸೆಲ್ಫ್ ಎಗೇನ್ ಜ್ಞಾನ ಅಂಡ್ ಎಗೇನ್ ವೃತ್ತಿ ಮೈಂಡ್ ಎಲೋನ್ ದೇರ್ ಫಾರ್ ಸೆಲ್ಫ್ ರಿಯಲೈಸೇಷನ್ ಆತ್ಮ ಸಾಕ್ಷಾತ್ಕಾರ ಆಲ್ ದೀಸ್ ಆರ್ ಓನ್ಲಿ ನಾಟ್ ಕರೆಕ್ಟ್ ವರ್ಡ್ಸ್ ರಿಯಲ್ಲಿ ಸ್ಪೀಕಿಂಗ್ ಜೀವನ್ ಮುಕ್ತಿ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ಅಂಡರ್ಸ್ಟ್ಯಾಂಡಿಂಗ್ ದಟ್ ಐ ನೀಡ್ ನಾಟ್ ವರ್ಕ್ ಫಾರ್ ಎನಿಥಿಂಗ್ ಅಂಡರ್ಸ್ಟ್ಯಾಂಡಿಂಗ್ ನಥಿಂಗ್ ಈಸ್ ದೇರ್ ಅದರ್ ದ್ಯಾನ್ ಅಂಡರ್ಸ್ಟ್ಯಾಂಡಿಂಗ್ ಮೋಕ್ಷ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ವಾಟ್ ಅನ್ ಅಂಡರ್ಸ್ಟ್ಯಾಂಡಿಂಗ್ ದಟ್ ಐ ಆಮ್ ಬ್ರಹ್ಮನ್ ಅದರ್ ದ್ಯಾನ್ ದಿಸ್ ನಥಿಂಗ್ ಈಸ್ ರಿಕ್ವೈರ್ಡ್ ದಟ್ ಅಂಡರ್ಸ್ಟ್ಯಾಂಡಿಂಗ್ ಈಸ್ ಕಾಲ್ ಮೋಕ್ಷ ಓಕೆ ಲುಕಿಂಗ್ ಟು ದ ವರ್ಡ್ ಅನ್ವಯ ವ್ಯತಿರೇಕ ವಾಕ್ಯಾದೇವ ಮಹಾವಾಕ್ಯಾದೇವ ಬೈ ಮಹಾವಾಕ್ಯಂಸ್ ಅಲೋನ್ ನೋ ಅದರ್ ವೇ ಸಪೋಸ್ ವಿ ಸೇ ನೋ ಅದರ್ ವೇ ಆ ಲೈಕ್ ದಟ್ ಓನ್ಲಿ ಸ್ವಾಮಿನಿ ಸೇಸ್ ಬಟ್ ಮೆನಿ ಪೀಪಲ್ ಮೆನಿ ಮಹಾತ್ಮಸ್ ಮೆನಿ ಮೆನಿ ಗ್ರೇಟ್ ಪೀಪಲ್ ದೇ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಗಾಟ್ ಮೆನಿ ಮೆನಿ ಫಾಲೋವರ್ಸ್ ದೇರ್ ಆಲ್ ಜ್ಞಾನೀಸ್ ದೇರ್ ಓನ್ಲಿ ದೇರ್ ಆಲ್ ರಿಯಲೈಸ್ಡ್ ಸೋಲ್ಸ್ there is no question of realized soul that realized soul is also wrong understand understanding myself what is realized soul hmm? realized soul and all all these words only gimmicks like they are unnecessary divert your life vakyad eva maha vakyad eva avakyartham to understand this also without mahavakya you cannot get um, jeevan mukti if we say to understand this also you have to study 10 years minimum that much easily you cannot uh, accept vakya deva na only through mahavakya na so that is why knowledge uh, what do you mean by knowledge actually there is a um, definition of knowledge knowledge is a knowledge when the content of knowledge is a fact for you this is the definition of knowledge knowledge is a knowledge when the content of the knowledge is a fact for you note okay you can contemplate on this then only it is fact for me what my guru said in mahavakya taught to me it is a fact for me this is the content of my knowledge that is called a knowledge a knowledge is a knowledge when the content of the knowledge is a fact for me make this statement a fact in your life okay then alone it is a fact for me the content what is the content you are brahman is the content prakrutartham therefore there is no doubt at all ಓಕೆ ಪ್ರಕೃತ ಅವಾಖ್ಯಾರ್ಥಂ ಅವಾಖ್ಯಾರ್ಥಂ ಪ್ರತಿಪ ಪ್ರತಿಪದ್ಯತೆ ಅವಾಖ್ಯಾರ್ಥ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ಡ್ರಾಪಿಂಗ್ ದ ನೋಷನ್ ದ್ಯಾಟ್ ಐ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಟು ಸೀ ದ ಆತ್ಮ ಐ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಟು ಎಕ್ಸ್ಪೀರಿಯನ್ಸ್ ಆತ್ಮ ದಿಸ್ ಈಸ್ ಕಾಲ್ಡ್ ಅವಾಖ್ಯಾರ್ಥಂ ಐ ಆಲ್ರೆಡಿ ಮೆನ್ಷನ್ ದಿಸ್ ವರ್ಡ್ ಪ್ರೀವಿಯಸ್ ಪೋರ್ಷನ್ ಪ್ರೀವಿಯಸ್ ಪೇಜ್ ಅವಾಖ್ಯಾರ್ಥಂ ಆಬ್ಜೆಕ್ಟಿಫೈಯಿಂಗ್ ಆತ್ಮ the notion of objectification habitual orientation that is you know, something i want to experience and the notion and the middle varanam avakyartham i you have to join there i is there in between you see vakya deva plus avakyartham beyond the division adha triputi 
त्रिपुटी प्रमाता प्रमाणम प्रमेयम ऑल दिस डिविशंस आर नॉट देयर इन मी नो वर नो नॉलेज त्रिपुटी नॉट देयर प्रतिपद्यते ही अटेंस इति उक्तम इट इज ऑल इट इज सेड अतः देयरफॉर तद व्याख्यानाय टू एक्सप्लेन फर्दर मोर सूत्रम उपन्यासः सूत्रोपन्यास ब्रीफली I am going to give what are all the techniques, methods I am going to follow to understand this Mahavakya. Very, very important shloka, third shloka. In Vedanta Sara, we saw this. I will read the shloka. Samanadikaranyam cha visheshana visheshyata lakshya lakshana sambandha पदार्थ प्रत्यगात्मनाम हाईली टेक्निकल वर्स देर इज नो वे आउट यू हाव टू अंडरस्टैंड एस युअर ओन इन ओन टाइम हाउ मच टाइम इट टेक्स यू हाव टू सी वेदांत सारा अवेलेबल इन माय वेबसाइट वन फर्स्ट वेबसाइट दो आर नॉट हर्ड वेदांत सारा प्लीज लिजन more you can understand this shloka very well because this is also from Vedanta Sara only Sureshwaracharya took now three techniques are given to understand Mahavakya three techniques number one is Samanadhikaranyam number two is Viseshana Viseshyata नंबर थ्री लक्ष्य लक्षण संबंध रिलेशन लक्ष्य लक्षण संबंध पदार्थ प्रत्यगात्मा प्रत्यगात्मा पद अर्थ पद अर्थ मीन्स महावाक्य पद इट्स मीनिंग मीनिंग वी आर गोइंग टू सी दैट व्हाट यू मीन बाय सामनाधिकारण्यम what do you mean by Viseshana Viseshyata? What do you mean by Laksha Lakshana? Through three, three techniques, three way of um, uh, presentation, looking into these um, relation between words, relation between the words meanings and relation between the uh, implied meaning. What is that implied meaning? We have to see number one. Samanadhikaranya, first one. Samanadhikaranya means there is a shloka regarding this Dvaita and Vishishta Dvaita systems of philosophies, they don't accept Samanadhikaranya. Only Advaita accept this Samanadhikaranya. What do you mean by Samanadhikaranya? Here, Bhinna Pravritti Nimittanam. Just note the words if you are able to note, note. Then I will explain. Bhinna Pravritti, Sloka is not there. It is a different Sloka. Bhinna Pravritti Nimittanam. Samana Vibhaktikanam. Padanam Eka Vishayatvam. Samana Adhikaranyam. Samana Adhikaranyam means using the same case ending same case ending samana vibhakti kanam second line of the sloka not this sloka another sloka samana vibhakti same case ending pradhama vibhakti means pradhama vibhakti for example vishnu sahasranama you take vishwam vishnurva shatkaro bhuta bhavya bhavat prabhu all thousand names of uh, Vishnu, all are in a Pradhama Vibhakti Eka Vachanam. That is uh, Vibhakti. Case ending. Pradhama Vibhakti, Dvitiya Vibhakti, Tritiya Vibhakti. Seven Vibhaktis are there. So in Telugu also we have Samskritam there, Tamil also there. So same Vibhakti endings. Hmm? Vibhakti is uh, same. But uh, different words are there. Bhinna, um, bhinna pravritti naam uh, padanam eka vishayatvam. Eka vishayam. One subject only they talk. 
different uh, uh, features attributes of vishnu are given thousand names of vishnu one vishnu they are referring eka vishayatvam anna vishnu sahasra nama means vishnu and the sahasra nama that is the example for samana adhikaranya we saw this previously also but very difficult to remember all this ek padanam ek vishayatvam samana adhikaranyam so the same case ending in arsa so asteria says uh, tattva masi will come later how you have to see samana adhikaran samana means um, common samana means common adhikarana means object common object when we chant vishnu sahasranama what is the common object in all those thousand names in vishnu i am talking about vishnu vashatkarah vishnu and all the vishva vishnu vashatkar bhuta bhavya bhavat prabhu bhuta bhavya bhavat prabhu referring to vishnu thousand names you take referring to vishnu so the object is one names words are many common one object for all of them vishnu 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 correct this is called samana adhikaranam adhikaranyam means common object common object of descriptions by many words thousand words thousand ways of description achutaha keshavaha so many names and descriptions by many words common object one object this is called samana adhikaranya another example also we can take geeta dhyana shlokam parthaya pratibodhitam bhagavatam narayanena svayam వ్యాసేన గ్రదితాం పురాణ మునినా మధ్యే మహాభారతం ఈవెన్ యు ఆర్ టాకింగ్ దట్ ప్రపన్న పారిజాతాయ తోత్రవేత్రైక పాణయే ద హోల్ శ్లోక ప్రపన్న పారిజాతాయ తోత్రవేత్రైక పాణయే జ్ఞానముద్రాయ కృష్ణాయ గీతామృత దుహే నమ నమ మై నమస్కార్స్ టు మెనీ వర్డ్స్ ఆర్ దేర్ జ్ఞానముద్రాయ ప్రపన్న పారిజాతాయ కృష్ణ ఈజ్ వన్ ఆబ్జెక్ట్ బికాస్ మెనీ డిస్క్రిప్షన్స్ ఆర్ దే లైక్ దాట్ ఇట్ ఈస్ కాల్డ్ సామానాధికరణ్యం మెనీ వర్డ్స్ డిస్క్రిప్షన్ అబౌట్ వన్ ఆబ్జెక్ట్ విశ్వ దిస్ ఈస్ ద ఎగ్జాంపుల్ సో దాట్ యూ హ్యావ్ టు అప్లై దిస్ టు మహావాక్య యూ హ్యావ్ టు అప్లై టు మహావాక్య హౌ యూ అప్లై సపోజ్ యూ సే ఆదిత్యాయ సోమాయ మంగళాయ బుధాయ గురుశుక్ర శనిభ్యశ్ రాఘవే కేతవే నమ నమ ఐ సే సాల్యూటేషన్స్ హూమ్ ఆదిత్య ఆదిత్యాయ సూ ఆదిత్యాయ సోమాయ మంగళాయ బుధాయ గురు ఆల్ గ్రహంస్ నైన్ ప్లానెట్స్ ఐ డు నమస్కార ఆల్ ఆఫ్ ది మర్ డిఫరెంట్ నాట్ వన్ ఆబ్జెక్ట్ డిఫరెంట్ వర్డ్స్ Uh, are there different descriptions i do namaskara those words which are referring to soma mangala budha guru shukra shani bhya rahave ketave namaha so many words are there descriptions about many navagrahas not one object this is called vayadhikaranyam dvaitin and visishta dvaitin takes to vayadhikaranyam not samana adhikaranyam so this is about vai adhikaranam samana adhikaranyam next comes visheshana visheshyata lakshya lakshana very very interesting i love this topic next class we will see om purnamada purnamidam purnat purnamudachyate purnasya purnamadaya purnamevavashishyate శాంతి 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 హరి ఓం శ్రీ గురుభ్యో నమ హరి ఓం